everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to Shadowrun Hong Kong, sponsored video as always. And we just finished up killing a vampire last time. Unintentionally killed. Like, I wanted to like say, hey, you know, we're friends, but die anyway. And then I was gonna shoot him, but I thought it would be like a cutscene sort of shoot, not kill the rest of the party. Um, that's, that's why I killed it. I didn't really clarify that last episode. Anyway, we've got Captain Jomo down here. I don't know what he's gotta say, but we're gonna talk to him anyway and see what he says. Captain is busily playing some sort of gambling game on his comm link. It beeps and flashes as he taps away. Come on, Jemmo. Win, not lose. Maybe buy yourself that new hat. He hasn't noticed me at all. Oh, by the way, it's raining like cats and dogs. Actually, not. It's raining like downpour rain, not physical cats and dogs. So, background noise may be high in this episode. Don't know for sure. Stupid game. I always cheats me. Never a good hand. Now, kindly Chang sends you, huh? You need Captain Jemmo to take... You do a pirate. Oh. Not right now. Okay, let's not do that yet, because that's another quest. That's that's the old quest of Ruski up, up in... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's one of those quest of Ruskies. So, let's go talk to uh, Grandma over here. Grandma... Grandma... What's her name? Grandma Chang. Auntie Chang. That's the word. Get inside. Oh, hello. Hello, doctor. Oh, this is the doctor. That's right. Hello, doctor. Okay, this is what I'm looking forward to. He greets you in the name of all producers. How'd the shindig go? I got the information you wanted. As you explain the night's events from start to finish as you speak, Shen Yang's face grows ever more incredulous. Until finally his mouth is left hanging halfway open. He slowly pace, places the cigar in a nearby ashtray and shakes his head in disbelief. Well, ain't that a story and a half. Good thing you killed that bloodsucker. Hong Kong's dangerous enough without vampires running around biting actors and producers. That should put a crimp in Ma's business, even if he still has Wong. I bet getting fed vampire blood is pretty addicting. That's what the Sims say, anyway. All right, kid. I'll send your payment to the Matrix Drop. You earned it. You're right, I did. I was about to speak, but his comm link begins to buzz. Irritated, he answers and switches to speaker mode. Yeah, who is it? What do you want? Hello, Shen Yang. I just wanted to let you know that I've released Penelope Wong from her contract. If you're still interested in her, she's all yours. Also, I hope your business is doing all right. I'd heard you had some problems with cash flow. If you need a loan, I'd be happy to help. You don't sound too mad, Nev. What's the catch here, anyway? You must have had the next big thing lined up already. Oh, doctor, there's no need for it. Do you want to know why I keep winning our little contest and you're always playing catch-up? It's because you think people like Miss Wong actually matter. Think, you think people like actually actually matter? They don't. Stars are crafted, modeled out of talent, yes, but ultimately constructed. With enough time and effort, anyone can be made into a star. It's just a question of manipulating public perception. Maybe so, but I got her now. And your show's dead, in the water, without that star. What do you think of that, eh? I think I'm going to do what any good soap opera producer would do. Write her character out with a tragic death and bring in someone new. You labor under the misapprehension that viewers have loyalty. They don't. They only have appetite. As long as you chase stars like Wong, you will lose. Don't be afraid to think bigger, Doctor. Reach for the drama, not the dramatists. The next 30 seconds releases a stream of violently imaginative incentives at his invect invectives? Whatever that is. At his phone. Even Stranger Bow looks taken back at them. <laughs> wow. Uh, let's see. Uh, finally, he takes a deep breath and composes himself. That dirty little weasel. Insulting my creativity like that. The nerve. Go on it, kid. We're done here. Thanks for all your help. But I gotta get going. I gotta talk to the big guy about buying a bunch of sh snakes. Okay. Well, we got the cash. That's good. Alright. Uh, get evidence. So we can go back up here, get the money, get the money, money, and get over here. We can talk to people. I don't... You know... I'm at the point where I don't care about all the backstory now from all the characters anymore. I'm sure the guys, eh, some of you guys might like it. I just want to continue playing and actually get through the game. Okay, blue, check your new messages. No unread messages. Old messages, jobs directory. Claim the payment. You submit the job is finished. A few minutes later, message pops up. 1,100 new yen. Uh, go back. Let's try access this. Post pay data for sale. That's what I want to do. Okay, construction plans. Two days. Okay, pay data for sale. 
Museum Shipping Manifest. And let's post the Experimental Ares Research. Hopefully we can get that. Let's go back and walk away. I totally forgot about that before. I was thinking that there was a way to sell it, but I wasn't sure what it was. All right. Let's go in here. We're going to talk to the bunk. The bunk, we're going to go to sleep, and it's going to be like, oh, man, for the first time you got in Hong Kong, you wake up with the feeling well-rested and satisfied. Flexing your limbs feels glorious. It's as if you... It's as though you spent hours cramped up in a confined space. You can finally stretch your legs, climb out of bed. You push yourself out of bed and touch your feet on the ground. Sir, something stops you short. Your mouth. Something is wrong with your mouth. Investigate with your hands. You reach your hand up in the finger over your teeth. It doesn't take long to find the source of the problem. A molar on the upper left side. You apply a slight pressure to the tooth and it slides out of your gums with no resistance. This is... I just turned into a vampire, didn't I, from drinking that blood? Tooth comes free in your hand and imagine... An image echoes itself in your mind. A great chamber, hazy in form and outline. Clouds of red and mist that fill the air, perfuming it with salt and copper. Great columns stretching up from the ground to pierce the sky. And above it all, enormous grinding gears of a broken machine. In the distance, you can hear a sound, a desperate, frantic pounding. Somebody enormous at the door. Many somethings, all desperate to get in, scrambling and scrapping and scratching, unable to find purchase. The way is locked. You feel a tremendous sense of accomplishment. You've done it. All the others are trapped inside, blind and starving, unable to pass through the door of the chamber. And what lies beyond it are yours. A shrill giggling noise fills the air like the laughter of a small child mixed with the shivering screech of countless violins. The sound reverberates down your spine like an electric current. An intoxicating aroma of meat fills your nostrils. You have been starving for a thousand years. Soon it'll be time to feed. And just like that, it's over. The image fades, dissipating into vapor. Only the tooth in your hand remains. Oh, great. We got, we, we were vampirized, vamp, vampir, vampircized, whatever the word is. That's real cute. That's why I stopped playing Oblivion, because I got turned into a vampire and didn't want to do the quest. All right, Captain, let's do it. Wow, we're seven minutes in already. All right, head to the, the thingy. And we're going to take, oh shoot, forgot what it takes. Travel to the steel of dirt on tissue samples. Okay, yep, tissue samples. Let's do that. That probably means I need my decker. Okay, let's take our decker. Decker. And I like this guy. I don't really like the rigor too much. Yeah, let's take the shami. Actually, the shaman did pretty good that time. We'll take those guys. We'll confirm this. Actually, cancel. You know what I should go buy? Decayed skin and decayed lungs. I wonder. Hmm. Why can't I select myself? Whatever. Take you, take you, and take you. Confirm. Alright, we'll confirm it. We'll go. I don't... I'm going to have to play it smart because I don't have any more of the resurrection thingies. The battle res things. Forget what they're called. But we can see what we can do. Whistleblower. The, ta the ride out to Na Nalchi is nerve-wrecking. Captain Jumbo seems an expert pilot, but massive waves threaten to scuttle a small boat in every turn. Deep thunder rolls in the distance, and the edge of your vision lightning occasionally illuminates your target, the MV Nalchi. As Jumbo pulls your small craft directly up to the bow of the Nalchi, where you're least likely to be spotted, he throws a rope ladder up to the side, hustling you aboard before pulling you away. It's time to get wor to work. All right, we should be good. That is the right one, right? Yep, team. Okay. Got that. Give that to Gobbit. Might use that. Mummy spirit talisman. If we get into, into trouble, we'll, we'll do it. Alright. Game is auto-saved. Fingers are crossed that things will actually work. You have karma to approve. Okay, we can do that. Forgot about that. Oh, I thought that was not going to happen. Alright. Body. We could do more body. We don't really need to, though. Quickness. So we could do... Oh, I forgot which one it was again. Close quarters? I think. Uh, hit chance with melee and throwing weapons. Value of... I think that's the one I wanted. And then close combat. Um, yep, yeah, there it is. It's cyber weapons, too. So let's do four, and I can't do another four. Blah. Let's just confirm that. We'll be gone. 
climbing into the foredeck of an LG, you pause to catch your breath. The cargo ship rolls and pitches with the waves and the batter at her sides. The rain assails the deck. Deep thunder rolls overhead. After a tense moment, waiting for the inevitable alarm klaxons, you hear nothing but the storm. Lifting his nose up to the rain, Gauchu tastes the air with his tongue. He carefully turns his head, mouth open, to catch the the most noise. I hear nothing but the storm, and I spell no adrenaline in the air. I believe we have arrived undetected. Isabel stares at her calmly. When she speaks, she doesn't bother looking up. You can smell adrenaline? You can creep your every day. I will not apologize for what I am, or what it means for my senses. In fact, my existence, as much as your height, <laughs> ooh, is a fact of yours. Gotcha turns overseeing milky white eyes towards you. Your orders. Uh. Okay, we'll want to keep low and stay behind cover. Clicks his tongue a few times, then bares his teeth with a rictus grin. The storm is making it nearly impossible for me to hear. It'll, it will much. It will be much worse for the security on the ship. They most likely will not notice if we stay out of sight. If you are seen, they will be forced to use wired alarms, as the storm will make using the radius next to impossible. He rests the hand on the hilt of his sword and takes a hissed breath over his clenched teeth. We should hit him when, with all possible speed before they can rouse the rest of the ship. Okay. Oh, camera control panel. Wow, that's real nice. There we go. I've rebooted the cameras and patched them into our comlinks. Lock ship's security out. Couldn't get the cameras inside of that ship, though. They must be on a different circuit. So... Like, the first thing, it's like, oh, congratulations, you just found the camera controls. Okay, there's a dude, security camera over there. I'm guessing that's something that we need to talk to. Nope. Are you, are you coming around? Come back in here. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. No, you're not. Okay. I don't need to go up there. Can I come up here? I can go up top here. What? No, whoa, 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 whoa. What's this? That's like a walkway that I can't get onto. Okay, let's take a peek. So that guy passed back and forth. There's a security guard. There's a security conjurer. There seems to be a mage over here. A bunch of turd nuggets that way. I bet I can sneak in this way. I don't... This is going to be really harsh if I, if I mess it up. Maybe I should just take this guy out at once. Okay, get over here. There's the map. No. I don't want to fight. Oh man, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. You're so slow. There's a mage. Why do you have to pathfind? He's gonna come back this way and bust me out. No, he's not. Everyone's looking backwards at things. Should we just kill him? I like that idea. Got you likes that idea too. Or oh, that's really cool. <laughs> I guess he saw me. I don't know what's happening. Wow. That's awesome. Oh, healing four hit points per round. Okay. Really, really cute. So this guy's all up. I guess I didn't see him before. <sighs> okay, that's a 99 over here. Let's just take him down. Wow, good hit. Okay, I'm gonna bring you up. That's two. I don't want to run two spots. That's a bad cover. Let's use you to come up here. We're gonna we're gonna slice and dice this guy. We're gonna try to slice and dice him. We could also use our fist mode. Uh, that's an AOE, basic melee attack. I think this is better. Yeah. Okay, Gobbit. Use this on you. You should be okay. Let's bring you back. We're gonna try to slice this guy again. There we go. Okay. I need you to bring over here. It's two turns. That is so annoying. I guess we're gonna try to kill this guy. He's bleeding out. Control, we're under attack. Great. 
Say again, I didn't copy that. And not everyone. I guess we're gonna, <laughs> cute. It's gonna be everyone up in the business. Oh, come on. This is gonna be terrible. It's gonna be everyone coming in. Okay, let's do it. Eviscerate, which does the most damage? Nine, seven, it's a stun attack. Spur attack, spur stun, yep. Yeah. Go on, hit him. Negative two AP, and okay, he's kind of down. That's a sixty-three. What happens if I come over here? Let's take Gaichu, try to slice this guy to pieces. Okay, you're down. Come up here. Gobbit. Where is Bell? If I bring you right here, can you shoot? Let's hope so. If not, I waste the turn. <sighs> Whatever. I just we're gonna just fire down range here. Yeah, of course. Rat totem. So where is... Oh, there it is. Okay. Aha. I was wondering where these were. Okay. Can I get you on a ley line? That'd be awesome. Although you don't really have much for damaging attacks. Acidic fog. Need to get you in cover somewhere. It takes two turns. What happens if I bring you here? Can you shoot that guy? You can try. 60%. Okay, that was decent. Ah! And Kitty came in. Great. Now everybody's gonna come. Oh. Well, at least they'll have some sort of time, anyway. I don't even have... Man, this is where I should have had, like, that racket guy. Ractor? Whatever his name was. This is gonna get along, too. Yep, there's a summoner, or a conjurer guy. Alright. I'm going to stab this guy so I can get in cover. That should put me in cover. Now, gob it. Good work. That's not what I wanted. Excellent work. Got you. I don't know what to do with you. I gotta get you up. But I don't want you to get attacked, because I'm gonna need you. Can I put you in full cover somewhere? Of course, that's full cover. And we'll do this in case someone shows up. Okay, I need to get you up as far as I can, and we're gonna put acid fog in the hallway. As soon as I can. Oh, yeah. Oh! I didn't realize I didn't move you. And you're gonna die like a deadness. Oh, 26 is the last hit. Hopefully I can get a heal off on her. Okay. Let's try to get this heal going first. That's a great heal. Come on up. Now let's take our grenade launcher out. Hopefully it does some splash. It did. Okay, blitz. Concerned about this. I'm gonna do it anyway. Maybe two AP. And we'll do this one too. Let's see. Yeah, we'll do that one. Okay, he's kind of down. Got you. Should we take him out? Is that that's the rigger? So that guy would go. There's the mage. Should we go for the mage? I know more people are gonna come through. Maybe I should just take out one. Or we can just ah, you've got your buff. Rather 
Rat Totem. Let's do it. Let's cast one of these. Ha! -ha. It's my ghoul friend. Ho ho! Didn't quite kill it. Concerned about that one. I really am. I think I'm gonna go just YOLO it. Of course you missed. And of course you missed twice. Oh, three times? Wow. Now you're gonna shoot me. Ha <laughs> ha. There's another rigger, it looked like. That's cool. I don't care about that thing so much. Oh yeah, getting cover way back there. That's a great idea. That'll help out the cause. Alright, psycho thing. Uh, 4 AP escape chance. Oh, 0%. We'll confirm that. Okay. Um, that's, that's great. Okay, you're down. Let's go stun the mage up. Oh, dirty. He is stunned. Okay. We're gonna shoot. Get the shooting McGavern out here. It's not really where I want it to be exactly. Great. Slice him up. There we go. There we go. Is he totally stunned? Um, let's see. Should we buff up? Who should we buff? I like buffing you. I should have buffed it before, but that's okay. Ow. He's taking damage. Oh, you're running away. Ah! Flanked. Armor broken. Oh, no. Thanks for, thanks for attacking the guy I don't care about. Now we got a sniper coming in. It'll take him another turn to get lined up. We should put acid fog right in that hallway. I can't. Can't haste myself either. Oh, great. You're dead. Okay. And let's hit him with this one. Good job. You get one AP. 87% chance to hit. I was concerned more about the mage than anything else. Are you still alive? Oh, maybe I need to give him AP. Aha, that is what it is. All right. And it takes one. I got it now. Okay. It gets four AP. That makes sense. What is that? Chaos Ball? Oh, I like what I see. Can I get... I can't quite get it. We're gonna try it there anyway. Okay. 87%. Let's take this one for a 72. We'll try it. Oh, he killed it. Great work. Great work. She killed it, I guess. Alright. Let's see. Goblet's got one. Let's get some... Uh, got you. Let's see. You're already aiming up. Let's do, do you... Here, the aimbot. We don't have any summon spirits out. Okay, let's go in here. We'll kill this guy. He's got a lot of armor. <sighs> These guys all have a lot of armor. Now that shocked him. Do I want to come in here and stab, or should I hide somewhere? Let's go kill. Of course, you're gonna miss. Of course you're gonna miss twice. Now it's really gonna hurt. I wanna bring you over here. Oh, you're gonna run all the way through. That's... <laughs> wow. Is that another rigger? I think so. Welcome. Oh, grenade. That's real cute. That's really, really cute. Wounded 10. Get wounded 11. You have less hit points. 
What? No. Ah! I wanted to cast that up there. I guess that doesn't work. Okay, let's let's give the heal here. Just because you're down a lot, you got a small hit point pool. We're in a buff. We're in a buff your accuracy up to. Okay. Should we fall back into shooty shoot time? I'm not getting out of cover. Let's do the shooty shoots here. I don't know if there's line of sight. Ah, that's a problem. Do I have any grenades? Gobbit has grenades. Hmm. Oh, that's a good spot there. I gotta bring you out. Kind of spread out a little bit. Okay. I'll try that out. And we'll do the same thing here, though, it's nothing's gonna happen. The dude's just running around crazy, so is this one. Ha! <laughs> no way! Oh, of course he missed. <laughs> they both came over here? Really? They're on top of each other. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. All right. Well then, it takes two. I could go here for one. Cover blocked, really. Uh, just regular shooty, shooty McShooterton. You're used up. I can't really bring you in there. Let's bring you back out of cover again. Go to hide. Hopefully Blitz is, is good enough. And then we'll do an Overwatch yet again. Oh. Got it. Um, let's see. Alright. Hey, you're coming down? Nope, you're still running in circles. What? An AP grenade? That must be the stun grenade. Now he's asleep. Cover blocked. Convenient. I don't want to run in there because it's got the nasty goop on the ground. So, we're melee heavy now. Maybe Gaichu wasn't the best for this group. Hmm. I don't have any grenades with you. Do I have anything cool in here? No. I can reload or I can run away. Let's uh, reload. We'll shoot next time. I'm gonna overwatch you again. That's nowhere covered. I'll stand here. Okay, we'll see what happens. There's only three guys left. There's four guys left, okay. Five damage. All right, Blitz, you got this. Maybe. Four damage. That's still out of ghost juice. Goose? Out of goose? <laughs> Kitty's out of goose, too. I don't want to run in there yet. Give him the poison cloud again. Give him... Give him death. Give me liberty or give me shooty shoot. Of course, nothing hits. Uh huh. I mean, they're really low chance to hit anyway. We're on the. We're on this. I don't want to. I don't want to cast another one of those. Let's see. Anyone down? Anyone wounded? Eleven. Let's take you wounded. Now I can bring him in. I guess. Try it. Get one stab off. Oh, 
now he's totally out of cover. These guys are going to be nasty to kill, too. Ah! Run back in the junk. That's right. Take that 9 damage. Especially since you're out of cover now. Or you're still in cover somehow. That's cool. Both guns are out of bullets. It's a proxy grenade. What's it do? Oh, it's just a... Okay. I don't really want to do that. I'd rather do this. And just lob that in there. Hopefully it hits. It did! Critical, too. Ha ha! Alright, brother. You gotta do it. <sighs> there. You actually hit. If I hit Blitz, I could, let's, let's, oh, you're behind cover. I can't target you with that. I'll target you with that. And now, you do a stabby stab. <sighs> of course he misses. <clears throat> That's frustrating. <laughs> nice cover, buddy. Right on the other guy who can stab you in the back. Oh, just kidding. Can I try to shoot? Um, got you. You got more bullets, buddy. You got 65% chance to hit. Of course you miss. There we go. Finally, he's down. Okay. Right now we can reload. These guys aren't going to come in and do anything to us. So, uh, this video recording session got a little bit longer than I expected, so I'm gonna just chop it right here. Uh, about halfway, actually, it was about an hour, hour and nine minutes of un unrecorded or unedited stuff. So, uh, I'll end this one here, and we'll catch back up with more of the same tomorrow. Continue on with this quest. So, thanks for watching, and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. <laughs>